Game edition of the NFL on EA Sports. It's the New York Jets taking on the New York They go play action here on first down. This one complete to Jordan Reed. And he'll be taken down, but not before they work it across midfield. Now this one to his tight end out on the right side. And he goes down, but not before getting this inside the 25. Back-to-back -back receptions for him, and it's another first. And it's a tone setter, right? I think they're going to be looking his way a lot. Yeah, and I think that the way things are going right now, they like him as a featured receiver. Let's see what kind of adjustments the defense is going to make to try and take a lot of scrimmage. That's it. That's to his running back, complete. And he's going to take it in for a Jets touchdown. A great play there. His third touchdown now on the year. And the Jets have taken a first quarter lead. You do the analysis, partner, but with every touchdown pass his young quarterback throws and with the success that his team has had, I just continue to be more and more impressed. Let's both do the analysis. Impressed. Aren't we both? Yeah. I mean, and why shouldn't we be? We've seen him improve throughout the year. We've seen him settle in now, and you can see the confidence of the team has grown. Second and two. It's an eight-yard pickup, and it'll bring up a second down. Throw right side, complete to Williams. And he'll go out of bounds inside the 15-yard line. Hey, keep it going, bro. And I think that's a pretty good illustration of why they try to get the football into his hands out of the backfield. That was something else. And we talk so much from a defensive perspective about scheming and finding ways to take away the run. That means the offense has to devise different ways to get the ball in the hands of their guy out of the backfield. Find open space, let him run, and big things can happen, and they did right there. And if you're wondering how fast he was going, next and 10. He finds his target, it's Crowder. And they will touch him down, but not before he... Back to throw again. And this will be caught in the end zone. Touchdown, Jets. Jamison Crowder, his fifth touchdown now on the year. And the Jets will extend their lead. And there was no going through the credit him with a sack as he buries him for a loss of 10. Well, so much for setting the tone of the drive offensively. Giving up a big sack that loses that kind of yardage, not a great start. And they'll get it all the way up about five yards shy of midfield. Back to throw. He'll buy some time right. And he finds the tight end, Reed. And he is out of bounds inside the 35. That's very well for the defense. There's a ball thrown right side and complete. And this is going to be another first down as the tackle's made at the Saints' nine scores from yesterday's action. Throws right side, and that's complete. And he's brought down just outside of the 10th. Expected fourth down here. Escaping the pressure right. He can run for it, and he will. And he won't have the touchdown, but he will have the first down. And they're going to hurry back to the line now. Got a man, it's caught. Touchdown, Jets. Jordan Reed, his fourth touchdown on the year. And the Jets are going to add on to their lead. And remember, partner, that's a rookie quarterback back there. Apparently, he's getting the hang of this NFL thing pretty quickly. That three touchdown passes. You're right, he looks comfortable. What are they doing, anything in particular? Well, they keep talking about making sure they're giving him a couple of incomplete passes, bring up a third and ten. Don't be surprised to bring a little pressure on this snap. Got a man over the middle, it's Williams. And he is going to have a jump. They'll look to throw again. Going right, and that's complete. And able to get this one a 48-yard line. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. That'll be caught right side by Reed. And he'll go down, but not before getting this. Now they'll throw here out of the gun. He'll go over the middle to Reed, complete. And finally down he goes as they work it inside the 10 to the 7. And they'll begin by running the option. And he's taken down, but able to slip across the 35. And 10 coming up. 
Now a nice throw here right side. He hauls it in. Yeah, he takes this one down almost all the way Don't to the 30. It it's a big jet football as they've got the lead here, and we get set to begin quarter number four. Oh, there's that man again. It's complete. And he is out of bounds right around the 10. In from the 10. Eluding the pressure right. This pass caught at the four. He had nothing. Just chucked it free. Yeah, live to fight another down, right? Four step. Got a man. It's caught. Touchdown, Jets. Man, Tim Patrick, up. his fourth oh, touchdown on the year. And the Jets will extend their lead. He has really settled in throwing the football, and that touchdown here in the fourth quarter gives him a pretty comfortable cushion. He may be. And continues. A good start to the drive here as that's caught out on the left side. And he'll get this one down near the 20-yard line, just shy of the 20. Off the play fake, he'll look to throw. And this will be caught in the end zone. Touchdown, Jets. Jamison Crowder there to make the grab. And the Jets are going to add on to their lead. They were still throwing with a comfortable lead here late, and now that lead even more comfortable. And your first thought is, is there bad blood? Clicking in this one, a lot of points on the board. We'll see if that trend continues. Flush to his right. And Reed with it over the middle. And they're going to be set up down around the yard there, and now second down. Here's the option. He kept it in his hands. And, and he is in. Touchdown, New York. It's their quarterback scoring on the two-yard keeper. And the Jets find a way to stretch their lead. Well, there's just about a minute left in this game, and they're still taking it to the end zone. And you know they could have taken a knee there, but they decided to play this one all the way out. And I think their philosophy is we're going to give you everything we've got. If we just go ahead and take a knee now, we're actually showing you disrespect that way, like taking pity on you. They're not about to do that to their opponent. Jets Charles, it's one thing to win. It's another thing to win and put up the amount of points that they did. Why were they clicking on offense? They can't help but feel great about themselves, can they? I mean, what a game to put up that number of points, continually feeling like they're moving the ball and things are working and clicking. They think that they can bottle this and carry it with them. And as an offensive coordinator, you just don't think you can do anything wrong. Whatever you call, run, pass, it's all going to work. That's called being in the zone. So for the Jets, they close out this first half.